Look at this, an R8, which is basically exactly the same. It's a V8 though, that's hilarious. Look at that, awesome, nice. <laughs> you too. Look who it is. What is up? Hello, Paul from Supercars of London. <laughs> oh, thanks for the intro. Yeah, mate. no problem, no problem. Where at? You want to give us the intro? GVE. This is GVE London. Like, yes. I've known these guys for like five years. They're only half an hour away from me. Okay. And uh, I came down here when they were in their old unit, which they still have, but they do like PPF and wrapping out of it. Which and is near to here? Yeah, yeah, it's just around the corner. Oh, okay, Being okay. In there, they've got insane cars. Oh, really? Uh, I mean, the, well, I mean, yeah. just <laughs> I look at this. I don't think there are many places in the UK where you can come to see this many cars. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, yeah. this caliber of cars. Yeah, exactly. And that, that's what we're going to do today. The plan for this video is Paul and I are just going to walk around, look at the specs, talk around the different cars. There are going to be loads of noises because there's kind of workshop going on there. There's a bit of music. It's an active workplace. Exactly. I would say. So I apologize for any weird noises that will come out. <laughs> but first of all, look at this. You you are actually weirdly geeky with Lamborghini colors. So I think this is blue Nethans or blue, blue Nethas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it's very nice. It's are you opening so it? Cool. Oh, you are opening it. It's got a very nice spec. Oh, he's gone for the comfort seats. Okay, there, there go. we go. I would spec comfort seats on the SVJ though. Um, oh, I would too, I would too. Because the, the, the other ones look sick, but they're back breakers, proper yeah. back breakers. This is very nice with the bronze wheels, carbon. It's, it's specced really well. Yeah. It's like you can, you can go wrong on an SVJ quick, especially if you do these wheels. Yeah. Like black brake calipers, black yeah. center lock wheels. Yeah, no, really nice. Yeah. How much do you reckon approximately we're talking with a car like this? 400? I was going to say 370, 380. Okay. I think. Well, let's say 390 to be safe. Let's cut it in the middle, okay? The middle. Is that a deal? <laughs> <laughs> right next to that, we've got a beautiful, actually, really nice. A lot of the cars here have really cool specs. I like that. What, the center or the spec? Or both? Both. Yeah. So it's matte carbon, this one. Yeah. The SVJ's gloss carbon. This has really nice accents. So it's kind of like a bluish gray. It's a gray with a hint of blue, isn't it? I swear this was like a launch color. Of something. Not of this. But it was a launch color on, on a McLaren. Really? Yeah. I like the orange I've seen this. I like the orange accents. I like the orange calipers. And I like the sort of um, me a little graphite bit of wheels. LM edition. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah. Very cool. And it's got the window open. You can only open this on a Senna. I know. Yeah, I mean, nuts. Stuck in traffic in the south of France. Yeah, you're in big trouble. Yeah. You're in. I mean, those seats actually look horrifically uncomfortable. They're not that bad. Oh. Those bucket seats. I've only driven the Senna once. So. Oh, okay. Well, I've never driven one, but they put them in <laughs> other cars. <laughs> they put them in the uh, in the 600. Okay. Now on the topic of McLarens, <laughs> this is an MSO 688 HS. Awesome, awesome. I've seen quite a few photos of this one around London. It's a very well-known car. I've seen it in London loads. Yeah, very, very nice. This is about half a million now. Uh, yeah, I just would not spec it like that. Yeah, it's a but it's it's the Senna kind of spec, isn't it? Yeah. It's the yeah. Brazilian flag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're going I mean, for that whole look. It makes sense, but... I mean, these canards are quite nice. I do like the canards there. The spec, yeah, it is bold. What's going on here? <laughs> I think that's a throwback to some sort of race car. Yeah. But yeah, pretty nice. Oh look, it's got I've never seen that steering wheel before. Carbon round top. Oh yeah. Very Ferrari like. Quite nice. Oh, you okay? Yeah, just had, like, I just bent down and like my lungs got squashed so. <laughs> That's a bit worrying. Um, <laughs> okay, wait, let's let's go let's go this let's go deep in the Ferrari yeah. section and then come back out. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, it's your favourite. Uh, there's a I've over there, so I'm happy. Okay, we'll we'll go for that after. This actually you I think you you're quite like this. No, it's got Voss and wheels. It's nuts. Absolutely not. <laughs> it actually completely changes the car. I like the wheels, the spec and everything. Not so sure about. Okay, well, there you go. Yeah, first. What about Pista? Boring. Boring as well. Yeah. What about looks wise? Yeah, they look cool, but they still got the same twin turbo V8. Yeah, I'll agree with you on that. The V8 is nowhere near as exciting. Looks epic. Yeah, this this is nice spec actually. You've seen it's got the passenger display. Many memories of blue FF in Monaco. Yeah, none of which we'll speak about on this YouTube channel. But yeah, it's got full carbon interior and the passenger display. That is sick. Yeah, 120 grand, sir. Really? Yeah. Bad. Look at the panoramic roof. Oh, it's got. Has it got? Oh yeah. And that's really cool. I'm definitely getting copyrighted. <laughs> what? Because music? music. Yeah. No, probably. Just what are we? This? No, that. No. I know. I really like 599s. Um, yeah, me not. <laughs> <laughs> I, this one actually is pretty. It's actually a nice spec. This yeah, it's quite a nice spec. Interior, it's got the standard seats though. It doesn't have the Daytona seats. Yeah, but that's cool. Is it? Yeah. Okay. There you go, buddy. At first. This is this is cool. You know what? These are cool as. Have you seen 
you seen this? Have you seen the inside of this? Is there a manual? Yeah. <laughs> oh. I just looked in and I was like, oh no. my god. I'm you, not too sure about red on red. Do you know I've driven a manual 430 and it is the nicest gearbox ever. Oh, I'm not surprised. It is so nice. You know, only people with real, real taste buy 430s. Yeah. <laughs> I had to work that one out. I thought you were going to go with manual because you're, you're all right. And I was like, I can no, agree with either that. manual cars, gated yeah. shifters or 430s. Yeah. If you own proper either guys. of those, proper, proper guys. That's a panel one. Changes the car. I think what F do you mean you just realized that's an F12? F12 and Scud are the two Ferraris that I think I'd want. Yeah? And I'd actually F12 and Scud? Yeah? What about 599 GTO? No, I'd have an F12. Really? Yeah. Oh, interesting. I'm really like basic. Okay, I do. I do really like F12s, and they're actually pretty good value at the moment. But yeah, black F12. They're like 160 now. Yeah. So go on then. Tell me. Walk me through this. I, Dream. I'm, yeah, Dream. literally in love with this. It is so so cool. Like when you look at it down here, like with the tinted tail light. Yeah, we've spoken about Aventadors for a long time, and I. Since 2011, since they came out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> But I don't know, there's something about them. Because on with a fi with a good finance deal, first gen Aventadors aren't, you know, they're, yeah, they're think, still think, ridiculously think, expensive, but... I think they can come out, I think if you just put 10% in on an Aventador off the top of my head, not that I've looked into it at all, is around <laughs> 1,700 quid a month. Okay, 1,700 quid a month, and you're putting about 20,000 down. Yeah, less than really. that, 15, 20. 15, 20 down. Yeah, so I mean, it's a ton of money, but you've got an Aventador, which is awesome. And running costs on these? Oh, hi. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty high. <laughs> and what you do you know do you know a thing or two about um about these things? No. No, not really. Don't right. know what it is. Okay. Do Shall we move on to something else then? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's uh this is cool. It's got the re rebenton. Re why are you saying that? Because that's what you have to say in Spanish. The V is a B. Oh yeah, but it's in Italian. Yeah, I know, but the bull is a Spanish bull. Okay. Like you say rebenton. Right, okay. <laughs> They're an eighteen grand. The lack of relief. Eighteen grand optional extra those seats. What for the pair I hope. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be a bit worrying. Okay. Do you like this one? I don't like the kit. Yeah, I was gonna it's say. Got the uh, the kit around here. Yeah. Ro uh, these are the Merchelaga Roadster wheels. Okay. They're quite cool. I like the concave yeah. look. Um, I prefer my wheels. Yeah, that makes sense. But it's, it's, I mean, it's still a sick car. Yeah, no, it's awesome. Really, really cool. How much is this up for? 180. 180. Yeah. Okay. That's. Let seven. me. That is a Project 7. Let me just, yeah, this is a paddle shifter. 430. Oh, quite a nice interior, though. Yeah, it's quite nice. You know the, the buttons? Yeah. Reverse auto launch control? Yeah. To get those replaced, guess what a quote is on that? 900 quid. 2,500 euros. Wow. Oh, that's Thank you very much, sir. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah, I just got that. That took me a little bit of time. Project 7, that's 650S Spider. SVJ, I much prefer the one over there. I'm not gonna lie. This, this yeah. is obviously epic. Oh, it's a, it's a PPF, is it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Gloss, carbon, very nice wheels. I apologize for that noise, guys. Oh, bold. That's why, it's, <laughs> that's why it's here and not being driven. Oh, that. Great car. That is a great car. It's got the sports seats. Ooh, that is nice inside. Yeah. Full carbon. Alcantara, white stitching, lovely. This is actually a really nice spec. Really nice even, spec. Even yeah, it's even got the carbon. Um, carbon center caps. Yeah. It's got the carbon here as well. Carbon challenge grill here. Has it? Oh, yeah. Italian flag. This, this is a big is spec. This is a really nice spec. <laughs> yeah. It's got the red calipers as well. Oh, carbon here. Carbon oh, wow. on those grills. Yeah, that is crazy. I think um, all of that side is stuff we probably already just filmed, apart from a rose gold i8, but like yeah. Hurricane. But I mean, we've got, let's give them a quick little run through. We've got a GTR, 720S, 570. Oh, so th this is really cool. This 600, 675 LT, sorry. In this spec is awesome. With the orange contrast inside. That is very, very nice. How much are those going for now? 270, Christ. We've got another one. Wait, we were about to not talk about the P1. We should probably mention the P1. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it is awesome. Have I driven, no, I've never driven a P, I've driven a 918. I haven't driven a P1 or a LaFerrari. This is um, the best to drive out of all the This is the best to drive. It's so low, I'd forgotten how low it is. It's in race mode. Yeah, I mean, that will do it, but wow. They do look good in yellow. I know, there's a yellow 720S there, and there's epic. Let's see. Oh yeah, imagine having those, that's your daily, and that's your weekend car. <laughs> yeah, this is pretty epic, this P1. Red calipers as well, very nice. Is the price on here? Okay, wait, don't look, don't look. I just looked. Oh, 
I was gonna get you to guess. <laughs> yeah, 1.25 million pounds. Awesome, with all the carbon. Oh, these things, I have to admit, when you do get up close to them, I mean, even in photos, they look epic, but when you're up close, it's just another level. That wing, I mean, I guess compared to the center wing, it's tiny, but it is very nice. Phantom 8 as well, that's one of the most expensive cars in here. Why have you got so many phones? No, 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 just one was buzzing. Oh, okay. New Continental, oh, that's a first edition Continental GTC. V12 Vantage. Did you see anything particularly exciting Not or really. no? There's a car that I want to show you outside though. Oh, okay. Sorry. All right. Follow me. <laughs> Follow me outdoors. That's very wacky. It's probably going to make a lot of noise here. These are really cool, by the way. Flat nose. Yeah, they are. Gambala. Oh, <laughs> Christ. Oh, I didn't even clock that. Oh, that is absolutely epic. Those seats. LP670 SV. Awesome. Bit dusty around front. Oh, God. There are, yeah, there are a lot of cars here. Oh, yeah. So many cars. Oh, we got Gallardo's 600 LT. Very nice. Oh, sorry. That's my... That's a video going live. Yeah, that's a video going live. My bad. 5 p.m. 5 p.m. Okay. <laughs> My, yeah. Yeah, is it the piece that you want to show yeah. me? That is so cool. So it's got Novitec springs, so it's been lowered. Okay. It's got the Novitec carbon tail light tips, which I'll show you. Yeah. And I've heard it, it's got Novitec DCAT exhaust. Yeah, does it sound good? It sounds way better than any other turbocharged Ferrari, but I mean, your Scud sounds way better than it. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. it's a piece to with at least a nice sounding exhaust. Would you, would this tempt you? I mean, that is stunning. It's uh, as good as it gets, right? That is so nice. I want to see these, what are the rear? <gasps> oh, yes. I do, I do see, I do see Paul. That is, is so this cool. Is, this is Dream Spec Pista. I think this is honestly because it's not even normal red, it's like Rosso Fuoco. What did you say? Fuku. Fuoco. It's Fuoco. <laughs> no, very cool. There are a lot of cool spec cars around here, aren't there? I mean, that 720 is pretty wacky and in purple. Yeah, it is nice. And this turbo. It's a nice wrap. This is a wrap. Yeah, it is a wrap, isn't it? It's quite a nice wrap with the center locks and the yellow canopers. Very nice. They're pretty good value now, these 991 turbos. Is your phone ringing again? It's good to have you on the channel. Take care. We're going to walk around. <laughs> Look, 360. We've all seen two glass action going on. Model 3. This LT is pretty cool as well. Very nice. I mean, the amount of cars they've got here. If we had to walk you around and show you all of the cars, this video would be way, way longer. Gallardo Spider LP560. Then a normal Gallardo Spider. Yeah, these are another Gallardo right here. Oh, is that a... This is a Black Series, isn't it? Oh, yeah. C63 MG Black Series. Look at that. These things are epic. Going up in value very very quickly as well very nice yeah and then amg gts is this god it looks like this maybe this is a manual manual 430 second manual 430 with the daytona seats red stitching this is purely us having a geek out and discovering cars at the same time that is awesome manual 430s are properly rare the last manual v8 they made though i believe they made a few of the californias in manual um, which is based on the same engine but yeah i hope there's not too much wind noise another 600 675 lt god i keep saying that and another black series christ i didn't even noticed Another Black Series, having two right next to each other. That is epic. Very cool. Uh, okay, Paul. Oh, he's still on the phone. Never mind. Yeah, that pista is beyond cool. Okay, well, very, very nice. I'm gonna go finish the video inside. He's off the phone now, yeah. and we're getting a startup. I'm gonna go like in proper danger zone right here. Yeah, How loud is it? It's pretty loud. loud. Okay, <laughs> am I gonna regret this? <laughs> Well, that sounded pretty good. Did sound good. And some epic, epic cars here. Thank you for inviting me. Well, actually, no, I found out you were coming oh, here oh, and then thanks. I texted you and I was like, <laughs> I'm going to come too. So you didn't invite me, but it was good to see you. Yeah, and, and you. We'll be doing some stuff. We're thinking about doing some stuff around F1. And uh, yeah, I'm sure we'll be down road in Monaco trips. soon. Road trips. We want to do lots of road trips. But anyways, take care, guys. Subscribe to Paul. Subscribe to this channel and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.